Savior Jesus Christ. He command of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. We now baptize this, our sister, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Amen. Music is the celebration of the hard life here in Kentucky. The home music and the church singing are a way of holding on to the old dignity. Music is not an escape. It gives a way of making life possible to go on. Life is hard here, and music is the celebration. Hazard, Kentucky in 1962 is reminiscent of the depression of the 1930s. People are in town looking for work. They say these are the worst times they have ever seen. In earlier years, these hills of eastern Kentucky provided land for farming to raise enough food to live on. But now the mountains are about worn out. Farms gave way to mining, and now machinery is replacing the miners. Times are hard, and people don't see how they're going to get better. How long you had this one? Let me look at this one. How long you had this one? This is Roscoe Holcomb, an unemployed construction worker who is no one different from his neighbors. He is faced with the same problems that they are. No work and no desire to move out of the mountains.
take us to a small kid, I've noticed it, that can't even sit alone. And you pull the strings on some kind of instrument, a fiddle or a banjo or something other like that, and you watch how quick it draws attention to that kid. And he'll, he'll do his best to get a hold of that. And it, it draws the attention of the whole human race. The year that I started trying to learn to play a banjo, and it's pretty hard times, wasn't no way hardly for men to get work. And so I asked God to give me something that I could do to that I could make a little money. And twelve months from the time I started playing with this old fiddler, I learned I guess around four hundred tunes that could sing practically every one of them. That's why I say that it is a gift. And I believe it, I believe that God gave it to me. And I believe it enough to I'm gonna let him take it. This is the regular Baptist church, one of the oldest in the mountains, where they line out the old Baptist songs. Doctors, ah, uh, uh, one of these days there'll be no need of hospitals, ah, uh, yes, one of these days there'll be no need of water, food, here, ah, uh, uh, but yonder in heaven, ah, uh, ah, uh, yes, for God has prepared, ah, uh, yes, some action for us, ah, uh, what's wrong with people today, ah, uh, ah, uh, yes, they forgot to shout, ah, uh, ah, uh, they forgot to praise God, ah, uh, Ah, uh, they forgot to take God as the Savior. Ah, uh, yes, let me tell you this morning. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Jesus is coming back. Ah, uh. dear Father, we thank you for this wonderful day. Thank you for the privilege that we have, oh God, to call upon our faces, to call upon our name. Oh Lord, this morning I pray for the removal of cares. 
This is Farmer Shepherd, one of the few people around with a regular job. He works in the big company mines. Uh, that's dropping. Don't be really sure about dropping it. Thank you. 
thing to me. How come a gold hanging on the rack for my coat on to me? The Shepherd family and Roscoe sing their music around the house. It is this music which joins them to the generations before. Their ballads and church songs are the old tradition from which the new music has come. Now hillbilly, bluegrass, and country rock and roll are heard alongside of the old time music and are just as much a part of the mountains. Before the coal came in, man made his living on the farm. Now again with no employment, Roscoe continues to work on the land and raises enough food to support himself and his family. The 
most recent church in the hills is the Holiness, where they praise the Lord with stringed instruments and shouting. Says I travel west wide world over friends I found wherever I roam friends I found. 